Dr. Jimenez and Dr. Jones are two plant scientists. Dr. Jimenez wishes to reuse a data set on plant growth as a function of light collected by Dr. Jones for reanalysis together with his own results. Dr. Jimenez received data files by Dr. Jones with plant identifiers and results of measurements. But which is plant 857? Problem, when considering plant 857, Dr. Jones sees a big plant. There was a confusion in the file with plant 856. Dr. Jimenez sees it small. They need long exchanges of emails and phone calls to understand the mistake. And what happens if Dr. Jones now works elsewhere? In Dr. Jones' file, the column for light can have many names. Par, red, redden, light, that only Dr. Jones understands. Dr. Jimenez says, Dr. Jones, could you give me the unit you used for light and how you obtained it from the measurements? Dr. Jones has no clue how to retrieve this info except spending one week in lab books. But, Dr. Jones' life can be made easier with a proper data management. All objects are tracked with a unique ID, as in your ID card. These are the URIs. Hence, the system automatically finds out all answers. Data are findable. This allows Dr. Jimenez to understand each file sent by Dr. Jones. Furthermore, the data set can now be stored in an information system. Data are accessible for a wide community. Users can access data from different platforms in different places. This generates more data and ideas than if one works on their own data. Data are interoperable. Each variable in file has a tracked name with ontologies and machine-readable explanations. Data are reusable. Fair data can make the difference in helping to develop science and community. The data are also relevant for other disciplines climate change, food security, food quality, ecology, and so on. Let's share them.